And now the 22 News Storm Team forecast. Time now 444 on this uh, Monday morning. We do have a mostly clear sky, some very thin clouds, but as the morning goes on, I think we'll see a lot of sun as the sun does rise. That breeze is nice and calm out of the west. Winds are going to stay light out of the west as we go throughout much of the rest of the day. So the good thing is not much wind wise to worry about, especially with temperatures being so chilly. Uh, so not really much in the way of a wind chill factor for today, but that'll change towards the end of the week. I think we got some really cold air on the way right now. These temperatures 18 in Palmer, 20 in South Hadley, 20 now is the temperature in Aguam. Look at Covington, 12 degrees there, and these temperatures are going to be staying only into the upper 20s and low 30s as we go into the afternoon. Going to say a mostly sunny day. There could be a few passing clouds during the afternoon, but overall the sun does win out and that is the top of the 20 day storm team forecast focus. Going into tomorrow, some light snow looks to develop during the early morning hours, continuing on and off throughout the day. It's not going to be a big system, but it's going to snow for much of the day tomorrow. There could be a few fluffy inches of accumulation, so I'll talk more about that in just a moment. But below average temperatures look likely as we go down towards the end of the week. By next weekend, we could be talking about high temperatures only in the upper teens and low 20s. So very chilly air on the way, especially for the middle and end of this week. Right now it's quiet, looking pretty good across the region. We got mostly clear skies and I think as the day goes on, we'll see a lot of sun, but there could be a few passing clouds during the afternoon on the 20th day storm team sky cast. So seven o'clock this morning, nothing but clear skies going to be seeing that clear sky continue through the morning. Here we are around lunchtime. You can see mostly sunny skies, but there is that chance for a few clouds as we go through the afternoon, but it's really around 5, 6, 7 p.m. Those clouds do increase. We turn partly to mostly cloudy during the overnight, and then here we are 6 a.m. tomorrow. You can see a little bit of some light snow showers developing. 9 a.m. that snow becomes a little more widespread. Then here we are around lunchtime tomorrow, 12 o'clock. You can see it's lightly snowing for mostly everyone. That continues through the afternoon, 3 p.m. still snowing, and then eventually it does wrap up by 6 p.m. We are mostly clear and dry, and tomorrow this will be a clear night. So in terms of snowfall totals, one to three inches for mostly everyone. There could be an isolated spot that might touch four inches. Best chance of that looks to be, I think, in either eastern Friendly County here and northwestern Berkshire County. But I think for the majority of us, two to three inches tomorrow looks to be a good total. So for today, we'll stay mostly sunny and again, a few thin passing clouds possible. 28 to 32 degrees for high temperatures going through tonight. One of the teens and 20s, 16 to 22 degrees increasing clouds and for the rest of the 20th day storm team seven day forecast. We got that light snow during the day tomorrow. Look at those temperatures when the 20s all the way down through the uh, end of the week. Saturday temperatures could even get a little colder. I might have to drop that high temperature into the teens potentially, but either way a chilly week ahead and uh, even those overnight low temperatures in the single digits and teens. If you want to stay up to date latest forecast, you can do so by getting the free 20 news mobile app.